A lot of talent in the backcourt for both of these squads, Clark. Yeah, there's so many outstanding shot makers and playmakers in the backcourts across the league. I do believe it is clearly a guards league these days. All of these guys can light it up and will light you up. So clearly a shooter's league is what you see most of now. So let's take a look at the Phoenix Suns starting lineup. The deadly pair of Paul and Booker are the backcourt. Crowder and Aiton, the bigs. And it's Bridges in at the three slot. Now here's Paul. And the basket is good. Now Dinwiddie. Outside Finney Smith. Pulls up. Doncic, no good. That's a decent look for him. He just couldn't convert. Outside Paul. Pass to Crowder. Puts up a three. The Mavericks pull it in. Man, that's his shot. <laughs> Maybe he was too wide open. Booker against Dinwiddie. Wood outside. Now McGee. Wood outside. Shot clock at six. Again the miss by the Mavericks. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. You just missed it. Bridges passes to Aiden. Outside Paul. Aiden with a screen. Fires for three. They grab their own miss. Great D that time from McGee. The Mavericks have gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Pass to Doncic. Wood outside. Doncic outside. And Wood with the stuff. Wood flying up to slam down the alley-oop emphatically. Paul with it. Booker with it. Aiden, a screen on Dinwiddie. Booker finds Aiden. Chalk up two there. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. The Mavericks have gone one of four to begin this one. Dinwiddie passes to Doncic. Back to Dinwiddie. Wood, a screen on Bridges. Here's Doncic. That one goes. Now he's one for two. Excellent finish that time inside by Doncic. He's highly skilled. I mean, that's obvious. What's not so obvious is how big he is. This guy looks me eye to eye. Now here's Booker over Wood. Here's Aiden. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Aiden's gotten his second bucket. When you're trying to stop a guy like this, you have to match his intensity level. And we all know what can happen when he gets rolling. A hot start can turn into an explosive scoring night. Here's Doncic. On the wing, Finney Smith. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. I think that's one of his specialties, really. Finney Smith is out there to defend at a high level and knock down threes. Here's Paul. Hits the close range jumper. Just over three and a half minutes gone here in the first. And you look at the intangibles of Luka Doncic. He has some of the best court awareness in the league, and that shows up most with his passing and body control. Now here's Doncic. Can't get it to drop. And here's Booker. They set the pick. Here's the three. The shot, no good. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Now here's Doncic. Dinwiddie outside. Off target from outside. And the way Doncic can feel the defenders around him speaks to his great court sense, Grant. Uh, no question. And the elite footwork he has makes the most of it. I mean, one of the best at shielding defenders with his body. It's really how he can navigate through a defense with ease. Now here's Paul for three. Booker counted from distance. You know, Paul won't miss an opening that good. He quickly feeds the ready shooter, and it's all she wrote from there. Dinwiddie outside. Pass to Wood. Doncic outside. The three is up. Tries again. 
Wood finds Dinwiddie. Three-pointer. He's now one for two with that bucket. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Outside Paul. Outside Booker. From outside the arc. It's good. The assist that time from Paul. Booker's got six points. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Doncic, no good. He hasn't been able to find his touch this quarter. To me, it appears he's starting to lose his composure a little bit. We'll see if he can regroup and get back into a better rhythm. What a sweet assist by CP3. Here's Dinwiddie. Pass to Doncic. On the wing, Finney Smith. Releases. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Aiton's got rebound number eight now. Now Paul. Pass to Booker. From deep three-point range. Doncic pulls down the board. Dinwiddie outside. Oh, there's the alley. And the lob disrupted. Not to be. And it's good. Off the back of the rim and in. The Suns leading. And here's Aiden. Pass to Booker. Aiden, a screen on Dinwiddie. Booker for three. The offensive rebound. And Aiden with the stuff. I mean, come on, a seven-footer with a 7-5 wingspan. Aiden beats everyone to the ball and converts easily. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Suns. You know, so far in this one, these guys have been knocking it down from distance. You've got to like their confidence as this game continues. They're on a nice roll. And the other thing you notice is how determined they've been to get into the paint and get buckets around the rim. After 13 seasons with Rick Carlisle in charge, the Mavs changed their head coach in 2021, Clark. Hiring Jason Kidd, B.A., and a mem he was a member of that 2011 title team. That was a lot of fun to watch. We saw Dallas dedicated to the defensive end under Jason Kidd's leadership. A new voice brought new energy and a refocus, and we'll see if that can be sustained going forward. Paul, and it's blocked by Wood. Oh, what a denial by Wood. He relishes the chance to throw it out of there. Hardaway, the pass to Doncic. He shoots it. Hardaway, no good. Phoenix is shooting an impressive 47%. Pass to Paul. Johnson a screen on Doncic. Paul with it. Guarded by Kleba. From deep, Johnson. The shot comes out, and it's Dallas. The other way. Here's Bullock. Hardaway on the wing. Again, Hardaway missing. And it's Phoenix's ball. Leading by five. Paul passes to Aiden. And there's the foul. It'll go on Tim Hardaway. That's his first foul of the game. And a new group getting ready for the Suns. Okogie's checked in for DeAndre Ayton. Craig comes in for Bridges. Shamit, he's checked in for Booker. And Payne is subbed in for Paul. So it's Phoenix now. Pass to Craig. Now Payne. Five on the clock. No good on the triple. Here's Bullock. Looking for his first basket still in this one. And here's Doncic outside. Drills it from deep. You know, often once Luka gets the ball, it's all over. It's all she wrote. He's well positioned to finish that catch and shoot. Here's Okogie. Back to Shamit. Pass to Craig. Here's Okogie. From deep, Johnson gets the three ball to go. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. Now here's Hardaway. 
Doncic outside. Launches a three. And the Mavericks, another three. Boy, Doncic showing you his competitiveness right there with the back at you three. The revenge triple. Pass to Shaman. To the wing, right side. From deep, Johnson. The Mavericks pull it in. Doncic with it. Give him eight. Kleba outside. Pass to Wood. Kicks it out to Hardaway. From deep. And Craig pulls it down. Hardaway's gotten just one of his four attempts from the floor tonight. Craig with it. We've got 1.55 left to play in the first quarter. And there's a pick. And here's Payne outside. Can't hit that one. Now Dallas takes it the other way. Outside Hardaway. Doncic outside. Three-pointer. No good that time. Ooh, that's a tough break. After poor communication defensively, it leaves him all by himself. The three from Craig. First shot won't go. The Mavericks trailing. Left side, Hardaway. Pass to Doncic. The three. No good. That's his sixth miss in nine tries. Well, Phoenix is shooting only 39% in the early going. 58 seconds left in the first. Here's Okogi. Now here's Craig. From behind the arc. Sinks the tray. And the Suns lead by five. You know, of all the things Okogi does well, his passing tends to get overshadowed at times. I mean, easy to see how creative he is on this feed. Now here's Hardaway. Wood, the open look. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Doncic. Pinson, he's checked in for Doncic. Thirty-two seconds left in the first. Payne, a screen on Hardaway, and the basket by Shamit. Now it's a seven-point Phoenix lead. And you know, coaches will take possessions like that all day long. Phenomenal use of the screen there. And here's Hardaway. This one for three. And so it's Phoenix closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. We'll be right back. Thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter of action so far. And take a look at the Suns' performance here, guys. What are your thoughts? Give it up for their D. They're battling, communicating, and coming up with key stops. They've got them rattled. It's only the first quarter, and already they've made enough big plays on defense to last really an entire game. Here's Dallas now. Seven-point differential. We've got Maxi Kleba. Tim Hardaway is out there with Dorian Finney-Smith. And it's Dinwiddie in at the point. So that's who Dallas starts the second with. Hardaway, no good. And the Suns shooting around 44%. Not bad. Pass to Bridges. It's Booker on the wing. Out of bounds. It'll be Mavericks ball. And we have to take another look at that block. And when you're behind in the game, that's what you've got to do. Contest every shot and get stops. And for the Mavericks, they're shooting around 33%. Not the best offensive efficiency. Well, you know, we all know the name Hardaway, but Tim Hardaway Jr. making a name for himself. Another outstanding shooter that this league has developed. 
And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. Thanks a lot, Brian. Well, Luka Doncic, an all-star from his second season, and every year he's one of the favorites for MVP. But Luka says, quote, I still haven't won anything, so I've got a long way to go. Brian, if you didn't catch it, team success is the metric. He says the key is to win a championship. Well, he certainly gives them a chance to do just that, Allie. Thank you. Clark, how about the ability Hardaway Jr. has to score? You know, it's really amazing. He's averaged over double digits all but one season in his career. He makes threes, he knocks down free throws, and it really doesn't matter where he's getting his shots from, he's knocking them down. You know, he's somebody that teams have relied on to score the ball. Now here's Johnson. Knocked away. And so it looks like the Suns will retain possession here. Paul passes to Johnson. Just five to shoot. For three, Booker. Pure from three-point range. Booker's got nine. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Here's Penson. Kleba, screen on Bridges. Poke loose. Here's Penson. He can't get that one to fall. Excellent. D there from Booker. Pass to Paul. Johnson a screen on Hardaway. Here's Paul. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. It'll go on Maxi Kleba. Well, as you know, Grant, this game can be so hard on your body. As a player, how do you determine the difference between being hurt versus being injured? That's a great question, B.A. Look, sometimes as players, you need someone to protect them from themselves. Today's game, the teams today are so smart about protecting players and preventing things from getting worse. But it really comes down to the players, the doctors, the team overall, just being smart and having a big picture about the injuries. Paul hits them both. Making it look effortless. Send this guy to the stripe. He's going to cash in more than not. Now here's Hardaway. He's got six. Kleba, screen on Booker. Dinwiddie, no good. Probably not the shot they had in mind, but you can't fault him. He had a clean look. Here's Aiton. Banked it in off the glass. Nine points in the game. Yeah, this is where Aiton's comfortable operating, using his height and array of inside moves to his advantage. Dinwiddie outside. Shot to stop the run. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Aiton's for Phoenix. They've got two of three shots to go in the second. Paul passes to Bridges. Three-pointer, no good. Dallas has gone one of four from three-point land here in the second. Pass to Hardaway. To the middle. Here's Denwitty. It falls. He's now two of five from the field. Well, you know, guys, we know Hardaway can score, but when he makes these passes, it makes him a lot more dangerous. Up top, Paul. He has six. Johnson with a bucket. He made the most of that opening, teaching the defense a lesson. And for the Mavericks, they're shooting just around 32% from the field. Hardaway against Paul. Down low. Kicks it out to Dinwiddie. Just five on the clock. That one drops. Three for six now. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. Well, I'm gonna credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Phoenix has gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Pass to Booker. Aiton, a screen on Dinwiddie. Here's Booker. And another basket for Phoenix. Awfully tough play to defend. When you honor the roller, Booker just takes advantage. Now Hardaway. He's got six. And here's Dinwiddie from the arc. Can't get it to go. Three for seven shooting now.
Outside Booker. Fires the three. And the Suns get another three. And this is what they depend on Booker to do. Such a versatile, confident score. Paul against Hardaway to the inside. Dinwiddie outside. Down to five on the shot clock. There's the three. Connects from downtown. Dinwiddie's got ten. It's turned into a showdown here. Dueling from distance. Looks to me like there could be something personal taking place here. Now here's Booker. 14 points for him. That won't go. He's 5 for 12 now. Dinwiddie against Booker. Hardaway, the pass to Dinwiddie. The shot no good. Booker with the defensive effort. Paul finds Booker. Johnson with it. Here's Aiden. He's covered by Dinwiddie. And there's Aiden on the assist by Johnson. 11 points in the game. You can tell Aiden knows how to assert himself inside, refusing to back off because of some coverage. The basket counts That's and good. one. He'll go to the line, a chance at a three-point play. Showing off with the floater game. Not a shot you can swat. And Tim Hardaway Jr., a valuable offensive weapon, even if he's a bit of a volume shooter, Grant. Yeah, B.A., I mean, his efficiency has never been a selling point. But he consistently will fill up the box score and always willing to shoot and can create for himself. McGee, he's checked in for Dallas. Luka Doncic comes in for Dinwiddie. That one's good from Hardaway. You know, I think we all know that Hardaway Jr. is a really good scorer. I mean, the next step for him is improving defensively. Up top, Aiden. Pass to Booker. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Booker's got 10 points in the quarter. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. And that streaking rack attack is the mobile one drive. Yeah, talent is one thing, but it's about the want to. Up big, but not settling. Continue to press the attack. Now here's Hardaway. Nine points in the game, and there it is for him. Doncic has got 10 points in the game. Boy, that jump shot is wet. Hold this, says Doncic. Any kind of airspace, and he's knocking that down. Up top, Aiden. Hardaway against Booker. Again, the Sun's good for two. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on them. Now here's Kleba. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Doncic outside for three. Hardaway. No good there. The Suns go the other way with it. Here's Paul. He's got six for three. Bridges. Finney Smith pulls it in. Doncic outside. Doncic on the wing, beyond the arc. Phoenix grabs the miss. He came out today planning to do as much damage from three-point range as possible. Well, it looks like it's time to change up the plan, guys. Now here's Paul. Aiton, the screen on Doncic. Here's Paul. Finney Smith pulls it in. That's the shot they wanted. It just didn't fall. You know what? That's a confidence shaker for him, though. I mean, that's a shot he expects to make every time. Bridges against Doncic. Wide open. And that one's good. Doncic has got four points this quarter. Boy, once Doncic gets on the roll, there aren't many ways to slow him down. Huge night so far. Johnson a screen on Doncic. Here's Paul. He got a piece of it. And he lobs it up. And McGee with the stuff. And this kind of athleticism at the center position, pretty remarkable. I mean, McGee letting it all hang out there. For Phoenix, they've gotten 8 of 14 shots to drop so far in the second. Bridges outside for three. The shot, no good. And it's Dallas the other way. Doncic with it. 
12 points for him. Inside. Finney Smith's shot is off. Well, you got to miss sometimes, but that one seemed like a gimme. Out to the right wing. Paul for three. The Mavericks pull it in. Doncic outside. Pass to Finney Smith. For three, Hardaway sinks it from distance. Hardaway's got 12. You know, with good shooting form and technique and a knack for scoring, Hardaway Jr. is confident with the deep ball. Phoenix calls timeout. And as the coaches draw up their strategies, the players staying hydrated with some Gatorade. That's key to keeping them at their best all the way up to the buzzer. It really is. And every one of those players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. Woods checked in for the Mavericks. Bullock comes in for Finney Smith. And the Suns will go for a different look here. Okogie's checked in for Ayton. Craig comes in for Bridges. Shamit, he's checked in for Booker. And Payne is subbed in for Paul. Dallas on D. They trail by six. Here's Okogi. Now quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. Outside Payne. Shot clock at five. And again, it's the Suns missing. And Dallas with possession. They're on a 15-6 run. Doncic outside. Back to Hardaway. Takes a three. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Doncic has got five assists in the game. Yeah, he's in his bag from beyond the arc right now. You see his confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident too. As a matter of fact, I mean, if you're stacking up threes the way he is, I mean, he's doing all his work from behind the arc. Now here's Doncic. 12 points for him. Pass to Hardaway. Let's go with a three. Another three for Dallas. Tell you what, there's not much the defense can do about that. I mean, Hardaway Jr. just has a special knack for making difficult shots. Phoenix calls timeout. Tim Hardaway really making a difference here. With the way he's cooking, they have to find a way to run him off his spot more.
to Sharon. 1-10 left in the second. Six on the shot clock. The Suns need to get off a shot. A good look from Johnson. And the Suns miss again. And for the Mavericks, they're shooting a solid 50% throughout the second. And here's Hardaway. 18 points for him. Here's Bullock. And the Mavericks, another three. Boy, excellent recognition from Hardaway Jr. to find his teammate there. This guy's an unselfish player. Pass to Payne. Looking to end the drought. And he's now one for four after that one. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. A little back and forth from long range. I love it. That's a terrific answer there. And for the Mavericks, they're shooting an average of 43% from the floor. Hardaway with a screen on Payne. It's Doncic with a drive. Outside Hardaway. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. The Suns shooting about 45% during the second quarter. A Kogi on the wing. It's stolen by Doncic. And there's the drive. And he banks in the layup. Doncic has got six here in the quarter. Speedy drive by Doncic. That doesn't quite go together. He usually is going at his own pace, but he does take advantage of holes when he sees it. 52. Monty Williams and coach certainly some areas to correct moving forward. What have you seen so far? We've had a few breakdowns on defense. We got to recognize personnel giving up a few open shots to guys we've talked about. We'll be better as we go forward. We got to get out and run, but our defense will help us run more. It all starts on D. Thanks, coach. All right, good stuff, Allie. And we'll get back to the action at the start of the third quarter. We've got second half action for you. And if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. Tim Hardaway really making a difference here. Yeah, in the first half, he taught a class on how to make your teammates look good. And you know, that's what delights him most. That's what he takes most pride in. He loves being the chief facilitator. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. Kicking off the second half, here's Monty Williams' five. The deadly pair of Paul and Booker are the backcourt. Bridges and Crowder holding down the forward spots. And it's Aiden in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Nice work by Finney Smith, setting himself up in the corner. Mark that one up. Boom! The Suns trailing. Outside Paul. 
Pass to Booker. Let's it go. Hauled in by McGee. McGee's got four rebounds now. Finney Smith with it. Now guarded by Aiden. And he's going for the oop here. And McGee with the stuff. Doncic taking pride in setting the table for his teammates. I love his unselfishness. Well, the Sun's shooting about 43% on this one. Ball against Doncic. Pass to Booker over Dinwiddie. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. McGee's got his fifth rebound in this one. Now here's Doncic. He's guarded by Paul. Now here's Dinwiddie. Ten points for him. Doncic outside. Four on the clock. Pulls it from the top of the key. Dinwiddie, no good. I wouldn't say that's exactly his spot now. I mean, and you can see why. Pass to Booker. Aiden with a screen. Puts it up from 15. And the jumper is... Is good. Booker's got 20. One trait of an elite scorer like Booker, they take what you give them. The mid-range working for Devin. Time now to hear from our reporter, Ali LaForce. Well, the Mavericks this season trying to build a title contender around Luka Doncic, but not a lot of luxury tax wiggle room. Luka said, quote, I trust them. Whatever move they make, I have great teammates and we're playing great basketball. Ryan? Well, no one wants to see Luka in the playoffs, Ali. Thanks for that. And Phoenix has possession. The Mavs get their last shot to go. Booker for three. Hauled in by McGee. McGee's got six rebounds now in the game. Doncic passes to Dinwiddie. Fades. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Aiden's got rebound number 17, if you can believe that. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Booker for three, and it's Booker again missing. The Mavericks have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Pass to Wood, now Dinwiddie. Back to Wood. Doncic right side, fires from deep. And Aiden pulls it down. Phoenix has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Third quarter of basketball here. A little under three and a half minutes gone by. Fires at the elbow. And it's good. Two points. Paul's got eight. Chris Paul reminding all the young players out there, I may be a future Hall of Famer, but I still got game right now in the mid -range. Dinwiddie with a screen on Bridges. Doncic shot is good. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Doncic against Paul. No good on the shot. And it's Dallas the other way. Yeah, and Christian Wood moving here to the Mavs over the summer. Now, the Mavs knew they wanted more size, so they sent a number of players in exchange, but they got a deadly weapon to help them this season. Pinson, he's checked in for the Mavericks. For Phoenix, they've gotten only two of seven shots to go in the third quarter. Outside Paul. Out to Bridges. Outside Booker. Stolen by Dinwiddie. To the paint. Stolen by Booker. Pass to Paul. Crowder with a screen. And he lobs it up top. And Aiton with the stuff. Excellent timing by Aiton on the alley-oop pass. He's perfectly positioned to throw it down. 
Dallas has gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. Time called here. The Mavericks decide to talk it over. Dinwiddie. He's got 10 on the wing. Finney Smith. Off the mark there with a three. Surprising to see him miss here, but they'll be happy with that shot in most possessions. Booker, good. A versatile score. At 6'5, Booker has enough size to make plays in the painted area. The Mavericks leading. Dinwiddie with it. Pass to Pinson. To the inside. Here's Wood. Lays it up and banks it in. Well, we talk about it all the time. Hard work pays off, and Wood works extremely hard to fight for the finish he wanted there. Here's the pick. Paul with it. And Dinwiddie picks him up defensively. Paul can't get it to go. For Dallas, they've gone five for nine from the floor in the third quarter. Here's Pinson. Back to Dinwiddie. And he can't get that one. Paul with some nice D. Inside. And stolen by Wood. Outside Finney Smith. Out to the wing. And the foul on Chris Paul. That's foul number two for him. The Mavericks making a switch here. Kleba's checked in. Johnson, he's checked in for the Suns. Dinwiddie against Booker. Pass to Finney Smith. Back to Dinwiddie. Shot clock at two. Here's Penson. Dallas no good that time either. The Suns have gotten only four of ten shots to fall so far in the third. Paul passes to Johnson. And here's Bridges. 4-3. Drops in the three. Bridges has got six points. Boy, an excellent job there by Paul setting that screen. Here's Denwitty. He's got ten. Pass to Penson. From the arc. And Aiden pulls it down. Phoenix is gone. Only one of three from deep here in the third. To the right side. This for the tie! Paul shot is off. 
It hasn't been all bad shots for him, but you wouldn't know that looking at his percentage from the field. To the middle. Wood passes to Dinwiddie. Booker with the defensive effort. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. And, you know, you can sense his frustration. This is going to be a test of his resolve here. That ties it up. Booker's got seven points here in the quarter. <laughs> a legit sniper from downtown. Booker rises up with such ease from beyond the arc. Wood outside. Pass to finish Smith. Dallas needs to get off a shot. And here's Dinwiddie from the arc. That shot missing. Now the Suns take it the other way. Now here's Johnson for the lead. Finney Smith pulls it in. Finney Smith's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Pinson. Pass to Wood. Got it. He's got six. Strong finish that time by Wood going up and through the contest to put it in. Booker against Dinwiddie. Here's Paul. And the step back jumper is good. Paul's got 10 points. Well, this man knows how to handle that rock. Looks like it's part of his body. Pass to Penson. Here's Wood. Hayton with the defensive effort. You know, sometimes making it difficult for him to finish at the rim is all you can ask for from the defense. Offensive board. Uh, Mr. Bunny. Those are the shots you've got to convert. Here's Pinson. Wood with it. He's covered by Aiden. Wood inside. He's against Aiden. Wood misses. Bridges outside. Aiden, a screen on Dinwiddie. Booker for three. The Mavericks pull it in. Here's Aiden, and he lays it up and in. Grown man strength right there. Aiden just pushing through contact and getting it done. Now a timeout called by Dallas. And the Mavericks with some changes. Bullock, he's checked in for Finney Smith. Hardaway comes in for Penson. And Doncic has subbed in for Dinwiddie. The Mavericks trailing. Now, here's Hardaway. He's got 18. Doncic outside. Fires the three. Fires in the triple. Doncic has got 22 points. At the arc, Doncic can seem unstoppable. You've got to guard him closely out there. You can't give him any space or he'll hurt you. Here's Okogi. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Back to Craig. Clock at six. 
lays it up and in, despite excellent defense. And the Suns lead by one. Doncic passes to Hardaway. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Craig. Shamit, he's checked in for the Suns. Here's Doncic. 22 points for him. Wood outside. Pass to Bullock. Five to shoot. Hardaway on the wing. Let's it fly. Doncic outside. They get it again. Kleba. And finally, they hit one. A hard-fought matchup. Seven lead changes thus far. And these teams have been sparring from the get-go. Neither able to land the knockout blow. Pass to Payne. And he drives in. The shot that time not on target. Good D by Doncic. The Mavericks leading. Throws it up high. Out of bounds. It'll be Sun's ball. I'm not sure what happened there. You just can't give away possessions in this league. Twenty-seven seconds left in the third quarter. Pass to a Kogi. To the left wing. Here's Shamit. Here's Okogi. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Down low. Here's Johnson. It's tipped. Oh, what a performance by Luka Doncic. He has been the story for the Dallas Mavericks. Providing the scoring punch right now. Putting up a cool 22. All right, we'll get back to the action after this break. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. He's always near the top of the list for this honor. I mean, passes like these are his specialty. Well, you can't run away from the DNA. When he's running the show, he makes sweet highlight reel plays, night in and night out. Well, this has been a great contest so far. I imagine the fourth quarter could have more action in store for us. Doncic and Hardaway Jr. man the backcourt. Christian Wood out there with Maxi Kleba. And it's Bullock in at the three, the small forward. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. Now here's Doncic. Pass to Kleba. Here's Wood. Tipped. Now Hardaway. Some changes for Phoenix. Aiden, he's checked in for Okogi. And it's Devin Booker in for Shamit. Here's Hardaway. Doncic right side. There's the triple. Pass to Wood. Four on the clock. From deep. Rebounded by Johnson. It's never easy from that distance, but we see him drill those and shoot around all the time. Well, that looked to me, guys, like a heat check. And it was maybe a step out of his range. Finney Smith checked in for Bullock. The Mavericks shooting only 40% from the floor in this game. Doncic against Paul. Wood outside. Six to shoot. Ooh, excellent D there from Aiden. The Suns trailing. Outside Paul. Here's Booker. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That one on Doncic. An active shooter. Booker is clever at finding ways to attract fouls on the way up. All right, well, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for Dallas. Well, they have owned the Take offensive break. perimeter throughout this game, finding lots of openings and turning them into big shots. 
you know, another thing that stands out to me is their passing in this game. I mean, they've done a tremendous job sharing the ball and setting each other up for success. And the Suns making a change here. Bridges is checked in. So now they lead by one. Final quarter of play, about a minute and a half off the clock. Doncic with it. Outside Hardaway. Pass to Wood. Ooh, excellent D there from Aiden. The Suns shooting only 42%. Paul passes to Aiden. And Aiden with the stuff. And this is how dynamic Aiden can be on the offensive end. Keep getting him the ball, please. Here's Doncic. Two minutes gone by here in the fourth. Kleba finds Doncic. Back to Kleba. Hardaway against Booker. Oh, they get a hand on it. Just five to shoot. against Hardaway. It's Booker on the wing. Let's the three fly. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Woods got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Finney Smith. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. <laughs> That's a clutch shot by a big time shooter. And where's the D? A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Outside Booker. Outside Paul. The three. It's rebounded by Dallas. Hardaway's got four rebounds now. Pass to Kleva. And here's Doncic. He's guarded by Paul. Up and over Doncic. Paul, shot is off. Dallas has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. And Doncic, here we go. Out to Kleba. Let's it go from deep. And the Mavericks, another three. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. Boy, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. Now here's Booker. Pass to Paul. Back to Booker. Booker drawing the double. Here's a three from Paul. And again, it's the Suns missing. Tried to come right back at him with the three. Not that time. Now Hardaway. Booker defending. And he's fouled on the shot. It misses, so a couple of free throws here. Almost an opportunity at a three-point play. When Hardaway Jr. is forcing the issue like that, it draws the defense's attention, and I like his aggressiveness as a scorer. The first one falls, and the Mavericks with some changes. McGee, he's checked in for Kleba, and it's Dinwiddie in for Luka Doncic. Hardaway hits them both. Phoenix has gone 0 for 3 here in the fourth. Phoenix calls timeout. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. Yeah, you know, they had to do something, anything to stop this run. You can't just let it go on any longer. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Monty Williams was saying to his team. He said, quote, we are within striking distance. This is where we take over and turn this game into our favor. Let's go get it. All right, Allie, thanks once again. To the paint. 
And Booker gets double teamed. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three second call. The Mavericks on offense. They've gone on an 8 0 run. Dinwiddie outside. Pass to Finney Smith. Here's Dinwiddie. McGee, a screen on Booker. Five on the clock. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley oop attempt. Outside Paul. Johnson a screen on Hardaway. Ball finds Aiden. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Yeah, what I appreciate about Aiden is that he wants to keep getting better. You have to be excited about his future. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He makes a first. So hits one and misses one at the line. Tough miss at this juncture. They're down two baskets right now. Outside, Finney Smith jacks up a three. Offensive rebound, Mavericks. And that one drops. And, you know, with his size and presence in the post, McGee has a lot of value on the offensive glass. Ball passes to Bridges. Outside, Booker. The three ball sends it home from three-point land. Booker's got 12 points here in the second half. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. You know, they want the ball in his hands here because they trust him to hit all the big shots. For Phoenix, they've got two of eight shots to drop in the final quarter. Now here's Paul. Pass to Booker. Takes the three. Wood grabs the board. Wood's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Hardaway against Paul. Dinwiddie passes to McGee. Shoots over Johnson. McGee's shot is off. The Suns trailing. Here's Paul. Pass to Booker. With the drive. Shot clock at six. The shot won't fall. Excellent D there from Dinwiddie. Here's Hardaway. He's guarded by Paul. Now that's a textbook alley you. I thought he'd go for the slam, but that worked. It actually almost makes it a little more special. Grace over power is how I would look at it. Phoenix has gone one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. Aiton, a screen on Dinwiddie. For three, Booker. Mavericks with a rebound. Not sure if he just ran out of gas or what. He's been awful ever since the second half started. Not even been a factor. It's tough to get open in this league, and when you do, it hurts not to capitalize. Outside Paul. Inside, here's Aiton, and Aiton with the stuff. And, you know, this is where Paul likes to work his magic. Very effective at making the right pass in the pick and roll. Here's Dallas now. They're on a 14-6 run, and Dallas calls time here. Yeah, Coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. Yeah, and I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout.
Crowder. He's checked in for Johnson. Here's Dinwiddie. Outside Hardaway. To the middle. Here's Finney Smith. Wide open look. And the basket by Wood. And the Mavericks lead by seven. Really good pass from Finney Smith. He understands that you can't squeeze that orange if you've got somebody ready to catch and shoot. Up top, Paul. Defended by Hardaway. Bridges misses. And Dallas with possession. They're on a 16-6 run. Now Dinwiddie for three. Hardaway. That one doesn't drop. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Hall passes to Aiden. From downtown. Paul shot is off. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if he gets yanked soon. I mean, that's how bad his shot selection has been. Dinwiddie against Booker. Outside Hardaway. The three is up. And the basket's good. Off the assist from Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie's got four assists in the game. Boy, that quick trigger mindset. When Hardaway Jr. is firing away like this, you know he's feeling it. Now here's Paul to the inside. And stolen by Wood. away with it. Dinwiddie outside. Wood right side. That one is off. So Phoenix will take it the other way. Let's it go from 11. The shot off that time. Good D by Finney Smith. Dinwiddie against Booker. Dinwiddie passes to Wood. Dinwiddie outside. Just four to shoot. Over Booker. And Aiden pulls it down. Well, it's a make-or-miss league. Sometimes the Jays just don't fall. It wasn't a bad shot. And he's going for the lob. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. Who poked away. Here's Finney Smith. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Give that one to Jay Crowder. Props to Finney Smith. I mean, going up strong, earns himself a trip to the line. And the first one at the line is good. The definition of a stretch for Finney Smith is a really valuable offensive player. Luka Doncic has checked in for the Mavericks. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And the Suns shooting only 39% so far in the game. Here's Paul. Gets it to fall from the right block. Against close defense, Paul's agility and ball handling is really what makes the difference. Slipping by and able to get the finish. That was another look at our mobile one drive of the game just a moment ago. They're trying to come back in this game. No, bottom line, it's about energy and effort. Exemplified by a possession like that. Now here's Dinwiddie. Outside, Finney Smith. The three-pointer off the mark. Booker against Dinwiddie. Crowder outside. Launches it. Yes! And it's Booker with the setup. 
Crowder's got himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. And he lobs up to the rim. Pass to Dinwiddie. To the wing on the left. Outside, Finney Smith. Clock at six. Here's Doncic. Let's the three fly. Drains the triple. Doncic has got 11 points here in the second half. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Now here's Paul. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. He a solid inside play by Aiden. Staying strong and taking the foul while still putting up a shot. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He drops the first one, and that brings him within single digits. The second free throw, no good. Tough break there. And this is the problem with playing from behind. Missing freebies takes on greater importance. Dinwiddie finds Doncic. And they doubled up Doncic. Wood inside. He's guarded by Bridges. To the middle. Here's McGee. And McGee with the stuff. And guys, that's got to be the dagger. This is how you finish a game. Yeah, what a time to put the hammer down. Any hope of a comeback? Diminished. And it's Phoenix's ball. And here's Paul. Oh, McGee with the block. Boy, and the wingspan McGee has covered a lot of ground. Very useful for shot blocking. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. So the first one drops, and that brings him within 10. And that's good as he hits both shots. Don't do anything silly. Just ride out the clock. Yes, if they take their time and execute, the game is all theirs. Now five seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. And they recover it. A nice shot by McGee. And the Mavericks lead by 11. They got a big lift from their crowd tonight, giving them the energy they needed. Boy, they've given their fans plenty to cheer about, that's for sure. Effort, skill, coaching, you name it, they've done it. And so it's the Mavericks taking care of business in this one. A competitive game. You have to feel like this crowd gave them a little extra edge. Yeah, they really fed off the energy. You saw their activity level go up. Just a tremendous performance. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Luca, you played well tonight, and your team got the win. Those two usually go together, but what else made the difference? Yeah, I think we had a uh, we had a great game. You know, we had a. I think it was a great game today. You know, we step up uh, together, play good defense, and it was a great win. Team defense goes a long way. Thanks, Luca. Allie, thank you as always. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Allie LaForce, Clark Kellogg, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson saying thank you for watching the NBA, brought to you by 2K Sports. As New Balance presents our player of the game, Luka Doncic.